Hey everybody, Brian Johnson here, and damn, you know, sometimes technology doesn't work the way it's supposed to. I've been uh, recording videos, trying to update uh, my members, my subscribers to my mailing list, and I wanted to let you guys know where I was at with my marketing in my darn iPhone. Too many videos, deleted a bunch. We're going to get through this video because I've got a pretty exciting update I want to share with you on what I've been up to over the last couple months. You know, this year, one of the things I've done is... Uh, pretty much every year I come up with a game plan for my marketing. I know exactly what I'm going to do, what things I'm going to focus on. It really helps me to focus and stay connected. It helps me to uh, know what my priorities are. And when you have a plan, it's much easier to obviously stick to that plan than not having one. And this year was all about leveraging social media sites, Kindle self-publishing, and kind of creating the synergy of marketing uh, incorporating new elements into the stuff I typically do, like affiliate marketing, SEO, AdSense, WordPress, and whatnot. And it's been really exciting, and I, I kind of actually uh, coined uh, Revenge of the Affiliate as kind of the, the idea behind this marketing and the name of what I was accomplishing. And I, I've had probably five updates over the year as to my progress. I've talked about using Facebook, which has been awesome. I'm, I'm a Facebook believer. Uh, I'll hit 10,000 fans on a fan page in a matter of days. Pretty cool. And I've also, part of the plan has been to publish books to the Kindle Marketplace. I've done a bunch of publishing now. I've got a bunch of books available, and I can't believe the results I'm getting. I'm really, really excited about it. It's fun, and one of the things I want to let you know is that, you know, over the summer, you know, the back to the update, I decided to take some time away to really enjoy life. So in July and August, I, I did some traveling. I hung out with Aiden Booth. He came here to Colorado. I headed out to New York. I met Mark Ling, met up with Aiden again, ran into Mario Soto, hung out with Tim Castleman and his wife like a ton. Also met Paul Clifford, another great internet marketer. Had a great time, met a lot of people I've known for a long time, and kicked back. But during this time, while I was enjoying life, I was still building my business, I just wasn't working in my business. And what I mean by that is I was actively uh, kind of managing the process of having books created, having books written, or using tactics like recording audio and having the audio transcribed to create a book that I would publish to Kindle. And the results have been really, really exciting. And in this time, July and August, I was creating these books and publishing these books and getting crazy great results and with that that's kind of where what my summer was all about you know it was about taking time off but still continuing to build my business by working smart by outsourcing by leveraging technology by leveraging other people and ultimately you know continuing that nice cash flow and at the same time creating another residual cash stream through Kindle self publishing and that's what I want to tell you guys about today because, you know, I've, I've been updating my members and subscribers over the year with this idea of uh, Kindle self-publishing and using uh, Facebook and fan pages and, and updating things and tying in SEO. And it's been fun. It's been working great. And I'm to the point now where I felt like I really want to document this. I want to put it together. In fact, I had some stuff created for my own needs and that is uh, to make it easier to publish books to Kindle, to be able to create great Kindle cover images quickly and easily. And I've worked with my partner, Danny Ramdini, and we've created some amazing WordPress technology that totally simplifies the publishing process and takes all the headaches out of it and gives people the opportunity to create great covers. And alongside that is the marketing strategies that I've been talking about, the stuff I've been doing and, you know, ultimately what I've been doing this year is documenting my progress, what's working, what's not, some ideas. It's been truly a case study, and now I'm ready to release some information that's packaged up, uh, easy to follow, and easy to implement and get some great results. And that's Kindle Ritual, and it focuses on Kindle self-publishing, what I do. And this is a product, if you've enjoyed those previous uh, kind of Revenge of the Affiliate case studies and whatnot, this is going to continue that. It's all geared towards Kindle, but I have some other neat stuff in there too because it all works together. There's a great module on Facebook. There's a great module 
on uh, leveraging SEO and creating a website to uh, leverage the authority that comes with being a book publisher and author, uh, obtaining bestseller status. It's all included, very comprehensive, comprehensive ritual product. Now, the last time I released a, a ritual product was 2009 with Kindle, I'm sorry, with Commission Ritual, and that was uh, received very well. Helped a lot of people make their first dollars in internet marketing, and I'm really excited to get this information out, package it up, and put it out in a way where people can really digest it, they can really dig in, and I'm excited to see the results people are going to get because, you know, I can tell you that by releasing these products, I've seen the growth in a lot of people. I've seen people that thought, oh, I don't know if I want to do Kindle or I, I don't know about SEO. And then I, I sat down, maybe it was a webinar training session, maybe it was a video like this, and I shared some ideas and people moved forward and they did get results. And I'm sure that's going to happen. It's happened with all of my courses. And that's what's coming down the pike tomorrow, noon Eastern Central, with Kindle Ritual. So just a quick update, wanted to share some stuff with you guys. In fact, just to give you an idea, I literally just published a book uh, two weeks ago, mid-September, went Amazon bestseller, made uh, three figures in a matter of days, continues to make uh, numerous sales every day. Every day we get numerous sales. And what's really cool is you can sell something cheap, you know, $2.99 but you're not an affiliate, you're a publisher, you're an author, and you can earn 70% commission. So you can make pretty substantial money. It kind of reminds me of the AdSense days back in like 2003, 2004, where you could put together an AdSense website, uh, maybe over a weekend or a week, you could string together some time, and you could put it out online, and that could generate 50 bucks a month, 100, uh, 200, 300 dollars a month, uh, month after month, and I, I've had a number of websites online that have earned that kind of money with AdSense, and that truly is passive residual income. It's really, really powerful, and that's why I'm so excited about the Kindle publishing opportunity. Um, I, I'm developing my income stream now. I'm right in the middle of it, and I want to invite you to join me, so make sure you check out uh, the launch of Kindle Ritual, which is happening tomorrow. Hey, I'm Brian G. Johnson. I've got a question for you. Do me a favor. Leave a comment below. Kindle scares you. You hate it. No way. Books. I'm not interested. Let me know. Kindle, I'm making money. It's great. It's not as hard as people make it out to be. What are your thoughts on Kindle self-publishing? I'd really like to know. Hey guys, Brian G. Johnson. Thanks for watching and uh, we'll see you soon. Bye now.